All right, I got my pan here. My last few cubes of frozen bacon grease. Right there. And I had to quick dip off my pork chop. And I am out of my seasoned salt, so. recipe is adapted from our Dining on a Dime cookbook, volume one, our peachy pork chops right here. Now, calls for peach jam, I don't have any. So I've got some regular peach halves in syrup. You can use any syrups you want. Then I'm just gonna cut up all of my peaches here. Now, this is way more than the half cup that it calls for, which is fine. All I'm gonna do is pour out about half of it, and then Mike can just eat the rest of it for a snack later. Okay. There we go. Let me make sure I got my peaches all popped up there. Right, and then my vinegar. Worcestershire. I don't have any regular mustard upstairs and I don't feel like going downstairs so I'm going to do a dash of horseradish mustard just to give it a little zip too. And my Tabasco. This recipe is in the description below. And I'm just going to stir it up, just like that. It's done. Perfect. Take the peach sauce. Get all that yummy goodness. By the way, I've turned the heat off. Deglazing the pan. I'm getting all fancy like Julia now. There we go. Oh my goodness, don't that look delicious? Okay, peachy pork chops. There we go. Does that look delicious, my son? Thumbnail. Not so good thumbnail. Thumbnail. Hello. Here we go. Thumbnail and testing time. <laughs> Should I cut it first? Okay. There's peachy pork chops. This 
This one is slightly different than what I normally make. Let's see, there's a bone there. Hmm. Surrounded by bone. Here we go, let's do that. Okay. Ready? Mm -hmm. I added horseradish this time though. Mm. There you go.